When you guys join Voladis, type in colon colon extras in game and then type in my name FPK Merc to get yourself two master treasure keys, three bag of coins, four box of boxes, a five dollar bond, a beast gem, an easy weapon box and also three double damage scrolls. So definitely make sure to use my referral code and come and join Volaris with a link down below now. Boys, we are once again back at Volaris RSPS today and Volaris actually beats more than 250 players online every single day so it's one of the most active custom servers out here right now and boys today's giveaway info can be found in the description of the video and to be entered in this massive giveaway make sure to like the video comment your in-game name subscribe to my channel turn on the post notifications comment join my personal discord and also add me on snapchat fbk without space and that is all you guys have to do good luck and i hope you guys will enjoy the video let's get started in today's video i will teach you guys how to complete the halloween guest 2022 at volaris rsps so boys let's get started and i hope you guys will enjoy the video all right so as you guys can see i actually made a brand new account for this so i won't have any stats or anything i will just go and complete the guest right off the bat so boys the first thing that we will have to do to start the guest is gonna be that we will have to search a book self and we will simply have to spam click this one over here is out of home until a message is gonna pop up i just missed it i am not sure if it's gonna count i do believe it's gonna count and then we will have to search a table as well so that will be the next one so as you guys can see we actually found another one, so yeah. What you will have to do is that you will first have to click on the bookshelf until a message is gonna pop up, and then you will also have to click on the table as well. Then you will want to head to Golon Golon Azura and search the Sacrophagus until you will get a spooky clue. So let's click on it right now, and let's see. Let's keep on clicking on it, boys. Let's try not to die. Uh, I have a potion, so that's nice. Uh, but yes, we will have to click it until we will get a spooky glue from here. So that is gonna be the plan. And as you guys can see, we got it. So reading the glue will notify you to speak with the headless pumpkin. And he can be found by the bank stalls at Golon Golon Home. So let's teleport to Golon Golon Home and let's go and talk to the headless pumpkin now. And uh, yes, he's gonna be right over here, north of home as you guys can see. The headless pumpkin, so let's talk with him. The pumpkin lord is always getting all the glory. He is not even that scary. I could carry that sight easily. So let's have a look, boys. What is he gonna say? Let's make a deal. Bring me this list of items in return for spooky rewards. So you will have to hit continue. And then, sure, I think I can handle that. And then, first, you can go and kill ghosts and retrieve a ghost speak amulet. Or you can go and slay skeletons and bring back five mangled bones. So we will first go and slay some skeletons and bring back five mangled bones to the headless pumpkin and as you guys can see you will actually get a weapon for that the spooky blaster and that's what you can use to kill these skeletons i hope that i won't die because uh, you know this account is pretty much brand new so uh, yes i'm not sure how much they will damage me for it looks like uh, it looks like they're actually not damaging me at all which is nice uh, so yeah let's just kill some skeletons right here boys and see how it's gonna go for us we will have to get five mangled bones and then we can move on and get the coast speak amulet as well and as you guys can see we actually got one mangled bone right here which is absolutely lovely but yes boys the spooky blaster will be needed throughout the guest to attack and kill any npcs during the guest and you can actually start with either of the options to first get five mangled bones or a coast speak amulet Alright, alright boys, we will have to get one more mangled bone right here, and these bad boys are actually one in eight, so let's keep it up boys, 
we will only have to get one more and then we can move on and go and hunt for the beautiful Coast Peak amulet as well. By the way guys, Volaris actually has a lot of other Halloween content as well, for example the Pumpkin. Pumpkin Lord spawns every now and then and it's a global boss that people can kill. So as you guys can see, there it is, the Pumpkin Lord. And uh, yes, that's how it looks like. And as you guys can see, it actually drops all of these items. So Volaris actually has a lot of cool Halloween content. But guys, let's get it killed and let's see if we can get any lucky from here. And we actually got five haunted fragments and also six bag of coins. All right, all right. That is beautiful, boys. That is beautiful. So let's open up these bad boys. What will we get? Damn, bro, not bad, boys. We are at 1,600 uh, coins already. I will take that. But let's go back to the beautiful skeletons. And uh, let's get five mangled bones. Um, so, yeah, that is gonna be the plan. But there is actually a lot of Halloween content in this custom server. Like, it is actually crazy. Let's go, boys. We got five mangled bones, which means we can finally go and hunt for the Coast Speak amulet. So, let's talk to the Headless Pumpkin again and let's see what it's gonna say. Kill coasts and retrieve a Coast Speak amulet. So let's also do that as well. And the Coast Speak amulet is actually 1 in 25. So yeah, let's try to get it, boys. Let's try to get it. But yes, guys, keep in mind that you will have to use the Spooky Blaster throughout the guest. Let's go, boys. We actually managed to get the beautiful Coast Speak amulet right here. And we will now have to go and head back to the Headless Pumpkin and see what our next task is going to be. So... North of home, let's talk to the Headless Pumpkin again, and let's see, you managed to get those items for me, take these rewards and get out of here. Let's accept the rewards, boom, and we actually got a spooky clue number two. And as you guys can see, reading the clue will instruct you to head back, call on, call on home, and search for more clues. So you guys will want to search the chairs uh, for your next clue and followed by tables. So whenever you get a message from the chairs, then you will have to click on the, yeah, on the tables now. And after that... Um, we will have to go and search for candles as well. So let's also get one from here. Uh, let's move over here. Let's see. Let's see, boys. Let's keep on clicking. Let's keep on clicking. And yes, then we will also go and have to search for candles as well. But let's see how long it's gonna take us, guys. Hey, we got it. Nice, nice, nice. So let's also search these beautiful candles right over here as well. And we actually got another one. Beautiful. So then we can go and burn our spooky glue number two um, at the fireplace. Uh, which is gonna be right over here, south of home. So let's do that. Spooky glue number two. Use it on the fireplace and boom, we have done it. The fire destroys your glues, but look, another one has appeared. So as you guys can see, you will receive a spooky glue number three and it's gonna tell you to search through a pile of bones, which is gonna be, I do believe it was east of home right over here. So let's run there. Let's click on the... Let's click on the skeletons right over here, I think it was. And uh, let's see, boys. Hey, we got it, guys. Spooky glue number four. I find the coast villager to begin the next guest. So, boys, this is the part one completed. And now we will start with part two. So, as you guys can see, the coastly citizen can be found uh, south of home right over here. And to speak with him, we will have to wear a coast speak amulet. Otherwise, it will just say woo, 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 woo. But it won't do anything. So, let's wear the amulet. Let's talk with him again. And as you guys can see... Uh, can anyone help me? Let's see, let's see, let's talk with him. I have been trapped on this world by my brother. I guess I can help you out, let's get it. So, as you guys can see, you can either first go and defeat the vampire and get a soul part 1, or you can go and defeat the dire wolf and get a soul part 2. And as you guys can see, I actually decided to teleport to vampires first, so let's get the soul part 1 first, and the soul part 1 is actually, as you guys can see, 1 in 24. And this is able to be attacked by multiple people, and more than one person is recommended. But alright guys, let's see how long it's gonna take us to get the soul part 1. And let's try not to die here as well, let's be careful. 
And uh, yes, boys, let's keep up the grind. Let's keep up the grind right here. No fucking way, bro. It's actually 1 in 24, but we got it on the first kill. I will take that, boys. It is now time to move to the wolves. But if you guys don't get as lucky as I got, then you will have to camp here until you will get the soul part one. But let's quickly go and head back to the... To the coastman, which is gonna be, once again, south of home right here. Let's go and talk with him again. And uh, let's go and kill some wolves now. So that is gonna be the plan, boys. And, uh, yeah, hopefully we can get spooned like that at the wolves as well. That would be lovely. So let's talk to the coastly citizen. And let's teleport, let's teleport to the beautiful uh, wolves right here. So yes, boys, the drop rate for the part 2 is gonna be 1 in 24 as well. And alright, alright, boys, it actually took us some time, but we got the soul part 2 as well. So let's go south of home and let's talk to the coast guy and see what it's gonna say. It should actually be the guest completed right here, so let's see. Let's talk with him right here and boom! Happy Halloween, let's see. Uh, I did my best. Accept my reward. Let's see. Boom. And as you guys can see, you will actually get yourself seven haunted boxes, which are hella OP. You will also get yourself three terror boxes. And you will also get yourself two double damage scrolls for one hour. And this guest is also a partial requirement to access the terror boss as well. But as you guys can see, these rewards right here are super, super Juicy. So yes boys, that's how you guys can complete the Halloween guest of Volaris 2022. By the way guys, Volaris also has a super nice wiki page as well, where you can check out different events, guides, you can check out information about donator ranks, global spawns, a starter guide, and yeah, much much more. So I will leave the link of Volaris wiki into the video's description as well. But boys, starting off the Halloween event events at Volaris. Let's also check these out. So, for example, the Golon Golon Pumpkin that I already showcased to you guys in the beginning of the video. This event starts off with a global spawn and everybody will be able to kill it. But when you guys teleport to Golon Golon Pumpkin, not only will there be a global boss spawning, but you will also see Jason's over there and you will also see Michael's, Freddy's, etc, etc. So let's also check these out as you guys can see there we do have a Jason's right here and that's what they drop the Jason bet is one in 50,000 etc and the Jason bet gives you 15% melee max hit bonus and also 30% drop rate bonus and by the way guys you will need 15,000 Jason gills uh, as a partial requirement for Golon Golon Terror. Let's also check out Freddy Krueger as well. As you guys can see, that's what it drops. And you also need 15,000 Freddy Gills for Golon Golon Terror as well. And same with Michael Myers as well. You will also need 15,000 Gills of Michael Myers to go to Golon Golon Terror. So as you guys can see, for players to use this command, you will need to have all requirements. You will have to have the full Halloween guest completed, and you will also have to have 15,000 kills in Jason, Freddy, and also Michael. And inside this area, you will find four multi-bosses. The Jason boss, this is an upgraded version of Jason, and it's much stronger, and it has... 40 million HP and has some more advanced loot than his minions. And uh, you will actually need 1000 Jason Gills to attack the Terror Boss. Same with Freddy Bosses. You also need 1000 Freddy Boss Gills to attack the Terror Boss. And you will also need 1000 Michael Boss Gills to kill the Terror Boss as well. So not only do they have the Halloween guest, but you will also have to kill some NPCs and make your way up to colon colon terror and yes then you will be able to kill the terror boss but what can i say i hope you guys enjoyed my halloween guest guide at volaris this halloween guest actually has a lot of cool content and it's very rewarding as you guys saw so definitely make sure to complete it but yes i really hope that you guys found this guide helpful and uh, you know it's always easier to complete a guest watching a video guide than reading it from forums or something so yeah i hope it's gonna be helpful 
for some of you guys. Thank you guys for watching. All right, boys, we are now going to be wrapping up my today's video at Volaris. Make sure to type in Golon Golon Extras in game and then type in my name, FPK Merc, to get yourself all these items in my inventory. Thank you guys for watching and peace out, everybody.